Hola Paratudish! Welcome to my Obis show. Today's video, I will be updating you guys on schools that are started application. Yes, you all know that it is season for application and today I'll be mentioning two schools that have also started application. But before I go into today's video about the updates, if you're just coming across my channel for the first time, you're welcome. I'm Doris, or simply call me BioB. I talk about studies, migration, and also helping students in getting settled. If this is the kind of content that you've been searching for, then search no more because you are in the right place. Yeah, I dish out undiluted information. I give you as it is okay and so if you have not subscribed to my channel you have been getting values i know a lot of people have been getting values and you have not subscribed or you watch the videos and you don't even give a like or share the video or even make comment on the video what are you waiting for when you do all this it really encourages me to want to put out more videos and so if you have not subscribed, please kindly do that. Okay, thank you so much. So, as you all know, this is application season and it is expected that um, international students can now apply to um, the school of their choice. And one thing I love advising students is whenever you're looking out for a school, ensure that you look out for a school that you can pay the tuition. Yes, you can pay the accommodation fee. Like I've always, I've made a video on where I talked about how to search for accommodation in Portugal. If you have not watched the video, I will drop the link somewhere up here. So check out on how to search for accommodation so that not just getting the, um, the your, your tuition fee being paid, you can also afford the accommodation. And with these two things, you can be rest assured that life in Portugal would actually suit you or would actually be comfortable for you. You know, you're changing your environment and where you settled really matters okay so search for the accommodation and also search for the tuition so that the two of them work hand in hand okay so i said i'll be updating you guys on two schools that have started application yes some people have actually contacted me on helping to process the the the, the admission okay university of algab have started if you have not applied so check out for the school check out also for the course language it is very very important like i said or shared in one of my videos that i was taught in portuguese and it's really it's something that it's not really fun like you you know we being an english speaker and now in the class they teach you with portuguese it's actually not easy because if you're a student and you're planning to work and study at the same time it's not going to be easy why i did that is because i already have my husband here in portugal my husband already ending something and so that's why i could study in portuguese but if you are a student you're you don't have any means like someone sending you money back there at home or you having someone here already it might actually be difficult for you to balance work and study yes yeah, some people might do it but the truth is it's not easy so check out for the language course ensure that it is well either it will be taught in portuguese and english when they say it will be taught in portuguese and english it means that in the class if the professor is teaching you will look at the ratio of how many portuguese do we have in class and how many english speakers we have they have in the class so if if probably because an average portuguese understands english okay their students understand. But it's just that when the ratio of the Portuguese are now more than the English, it tends to be an issue. So 
if the course will be both in Portuguese and in English, be rest assured that your you would understand the course in the class because the professor will speak both Portuguese and English at the same time in the class. Whether it will start with Portuguese or start with English, so it's already defined when you are applying. So no. If the course will be in English or Portuguese. So ensure you are applying to a course that would be taught in English so that you can actually work. Because if the course is in Portuguese, I bet you, you would not have time to work because the workload is much. Yes, I've experienced it and I don't want you to face that. Okay, so ensure that the language course is being known before you apply. Okay, then another school that started application is University of Porto. So the first one is University of Agave, while the second one is University of Porto. Yes, University of Porto is in the city, is in Yes, it's in the city, the second largest city in Portugal, that is Porto. So know the tuition, okay? Know the tuition and know the accommodation fee that you are going to pay. Okay, there are some schools that have um, hostels, like school hostels. So try to reach out to the international department so that you can actually speak to them and they would connect you or tell you how to go about it yes you have every right once you get admission or while processing the application you can also reach out to this um, um to this icon international icon click on it and you will definitely see a contact explain to them you are an international student and you want to find out how they go about the uh, their um their hostels in the school okay this would actually help they can actually connect you to someone so algav and proto have started application and one thing i love about algav i think algav have more english courses for international students so if you are an international student take advantage and apply okay the earlier you apply the better for you these are what students should actually look out for and also lastly i want to say this there are scholarship opportunities a lot of students don't want to tap in into this into this <laughs> will i call it benefit yes it's a benefit tap into it we actually got it okay you also can get it it's by merit do it apply don't ignore anything whatever you see take advantage of it click on it there will definitely be a contact that you can talk to and with this your tuition fee would be reduced and you know what it is when your tuition is being reduced especially those coming from um the third countries, I mean Nigerians, Ghanaians, um, Ugandans, and so, and the others, okay? So take advantage of all this benefit. I know it's always beneficial to those who apply at the first phase. So be among those that will apply at this first phase and you see yourself getting it. I'm going to be dropping the link in the description of this video. So always check out, look out for the description of this video so that you can access, have access to this application. Thank you so much if you have watched up to this moment and if you know you've you, you 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 got something like value please don't forget to click on the subscribe button and also give a like to this video thanks so much and see you in my next video bye bye ciao